Hello, everybody. I'm Meg Wallitzer, and I'd like to invite you to my class, Five Things I've Learned About Writing About Family. So I've been writing uh, novels since I graduated from college. And over the decades since then, I actually don't think that there's a single book I've written that isn't in some significant way about family. Think about the word family. It's pretty elastic. We understand it to mean the people we're related to, the people we live with, or even sometimes the people we feel closest to. Writers are always talking about character, and of course, that's a really central topic. But I've always felt that the act of putting characters who are deeply connected to one another together on the page gives a writer a chance for really dynamic and exciting fiction. So if you've ever been in a family of some kind, then you know that the moments you spend with them can suddenly burst out in unexpected moments of tension, revelation. Oh, sorry, one more. That made no sense. Hello, everybody. I'm Meg Wallitzer. And I'd like to invite you to my class, Five Things I've Learned About Writing About Family. I've been writing and publishing novels since I graduated from college. And over the decades since then, I actually don't think there's a single novel that I've written that isn't in some significant way about family. Think about the word family. It's pretty elastic. We understand it to mean the people that we're related to or live with or even the people we feel closest to in the world. Writers are always talking about character. And of course, that's a central topic. I've always felt that the act of putting characters who are deeply connected to one another, though, together on the page can give a writer an opportunity to create exciting and dynamic fiction. If you've ever been in a family of some kind, then you know that the moments you spend with them can be peppered with interesting, unexpected bursts of emotion, tension, revelation, or even sometimes crisis. We're going to be talking about all of that. We'll talk about how something might happen in real life and how it might happen on the page what's different between real life families and the ones we invent, how a writer might take experiences from their own lives and transform them into fiction. We're also gonna be doing a couple of short exercises in advance and I'll have a chance to read them out loud in class. So whether you're somebody who wants to write or who loves to read or who thinks their own family sometimes feels a little bit like people in a short story or even in a novel, I think you're gonna find something here for you. And I should add that I'm definitely going to leave time at the end to answer all of your pressing, burning questions about craft, story, character, dialogue, humor, anything you like. I'm really excited about this class, and I hope you can join me.